This video will illustrate how to define your variables when you're doing an optimization problem. The variables will be x and y. This example has Sally selling cheeseburgers and hot dogs. And the reason most of the paragraph has this blah 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 entered into it is to focus your attention on the question at the end. How many hot dogs and how many cheeseburgers should she sell in order to maximize her profits? That is because when you're defining your variables x and y, you should be looking at the question at the end to give you a hint how to do it. Since it said how many hot dogs and how many cheeseburgers, the number of hot dogs and the number of cheeseburgers should represent your x and your y. You can define your variables as x equals the number of cheeseburgers sold, y equals the number of hot dogs sold. Looking at the question at the end makes this very easy to do. But what if you decide to make x equal the number of hot dogs and y equal the number of cheeseburgers instead? It doesn't matter. Either way, you should get to the right answer at the end of your optimization problem. This is how you define your variables x and y for optimization.